Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. On today's video, I am going to be doing a little bit of cleaning and sharing some recipes with you. So I have, I already have dinner going um, back here in the crock pot. I will insert some clips of what I did. <laughs> Before I forget, I'm going to put a, um, a liner in here to just make the cleanup process a little bit easier. So a liner in here. And then I'm going to, um, I have my cast iron skillet here. I am going to saute the meat first. Um, that's just the steps that I've always done and this always comes out so, so good. While the cast iron heats up, I am going to put the rub onto the pork. And this is pork um, sirloin. You can also use pork shoulder or um, pork butt. I basically wanted to just get really like brown and get like a good little crust on the outside. So I want to say I let this cook probably anywhere from, from four to five minutes per side. And I just keep turning it on um, all four sides till it has like a nice golden brown crust. Meanwhile, I am going to get a cup of water and then it's going to go. It's really hard to do one handed. Um, it's going to go out here into the crock pot and then um, I also like to I also like to squeeze some oranges I have these are not oranges these are uh, uh, what are these called uh, the cuties the uh, clementines so I, how many do I have four four five you can also use um i think that's it that's all of them um you can also use orange juice i find that orange juice so it's i feel like it leaves the uh, pork a little too sweet so i just use natural oranges um or clementines in my case <laughs> this one has a little bit of mold um but uh yeah so i just cut these up and then i'm going to uh, squeeze the juice right here into the crock pot and actually guys that's like the little secret right there orange juice is what makes this taste so so good on top of the brown sugar and don't worry it's not going to be overly sweet i promise i'm not going to mislead you i made this dish just so many times this is my own recipe and um people that have had it just love it and um yeah it's, it's really good not the best might not be the best but it's it is really good all that i am doing here is pouring one cup of water that i poured into the skillet once i removed the pork and put it into the crock pot one more thing that i forgot to add guys um i do add uh some bay leaves the this is four bay leaves however if you have like two decent sized bay leaves that will do the trick like I said, I also added that deglazed um, like goodness from the pan where I sauteed the pork, poured it in there, and then I also added the juice from the five oranges. You can get away with just one of the regular sized orange, but I'm just going to put the lid on it now and um, let it just cook. And it is all set to go, guys. It is that simple, and it takes, like I said, no time. So I hope you guys try it out. Uh, but basically, I have dishes to do. I have to finish um, 
making the girl's bed, well, Adriana's bed, and then just little stuff to clean up here and there. So I figured, you know what? Why not vlog, make this kind of like a vlog type of video um, and incorporate a some cleaning in there. I've seen other YouTubers do this, and I think it's such a great way to... Um, like make it fun i guess make cleaning fun and also for us that are behind the scenes you also kind of get two things done at the same time so i figured you know what let's pick up the camera and let me just get this all done and bring you guys along so um zoe is napping right now and it is really late it took her a lot longer to go down for a nap than it usually does um I have to put her down for a nap unfortunately she doesn't go down like she used to before but i'm gonna stop blabbing because i literally have like an hour before we have to go pick up adriana from school so i'm gonna get the these dishes um washed put away and then clean up this counter that is just a filthy there's you know just brown sugar and seasoning that i use to season up the meat so yeah let's hop to it or let me hop to it and um, i'll see you guys in a bit And it's like slimy like it has little these little dots just looks weird <laughs> that's why you guys saw me smelling it i mean there's portions that are like firm but then like over here it's like just i mean it's like slimy like i get oh see and my finger just went through that so i'm just gonna throw it away i don't want to risk anybody getting sick and the girls are mainly the ones that love eating the cantaloupe so it's gonna go in the trash because it's just not it's just not worth it but i did cut up all the kiwi most of the kiwi so at least we have something <laughs>
all cleaned up i was able to sweep and mop which is a task that i wanted to get out of the way um i am going to go into the girls bathroom now i have to change their shower curtain because the bottom of it is like pretty gross well not pretty gross but there's like one corner of it where it's like just dirty and i can't get it off so i went to target today and i picked up a new one and i also bought some um plastic gloves so i can or rubber gloves actually so i can um wash the dishes because my hands have been so dry they literally feel like it's a sandpaper rubbing against each other so and i put lotion i think it's just the weather it hasn't been the coldest here um but that's pretty normal for my hands around this time of year when it starts to get like you know the temperature starts to drop my hands just i don't know i have very uh like sensitive skin to begin with um so i just i just have to take care of them that's on and they'll rehydrate you know on their own but yeah i'm gonna get this changed out i have like another 15 more minutes before leaving the house i mean this is just crazy guys i hate being in a rush but sometimes that happens um also before i step into the bathroom because zoe is napping right there um, wanted to apologize for last week's video. I noticed that the lighting was terrible after I was editing and just looking back. But I, you know what? I needed to put up a video, and um, like you know what? It's not the best quality. Um, it, I don't have like some sort of light setting, but the kitchen lights and then just the lights that are, are around the house and natural lighting and um that day it was it was gloomy out so that didn't help however i do want to get an uh, actual lighting set so i'm hoping um by the end of this year i can buy one um as one of my christmas gifts so um, I'm hoping that'll change the quality on the videos, hopefully just a little bit better because I don't have like a professional camera, so to say. I still am filming from my phone because cameras are they're pretty pricey and right now it's just we we just can't afford it and um, the phone, you know, it's it's fine. It works for now. So yeah, guys, I'm sorry about that and I will just I'll try to do my best to upload like better quality videos because lighting is everything, especially for this industry of YouTube. I just wanted to let you guys know and update you on that. So I'll see you guys again in a bit. I'm going to go change out the shower curtain. <laughs> that i wanted to get done submission accomplished there i am about to head out the door and pick up adriana once i come back i'll just finish prepping dinner i'm going to make some guacamole which i'm not gonna film myself how to make it because everybody knows how to make it right um but i will come back and show you guys how the carnitas carnitas turned out and i can't wait to taste them because guys they are so delicious i do not mean it to brag by all means but i don't know they're just so tasty they are succulent they are just full of flavor they're just so incredibly easy to make i really hope that you guys try out this recipe if you do please let me know what you guys think and if you have instagram please tag me because i would love to see your tacos or just carnita dishes in general <music>
have a place that I can come home to Yes, I am on my way today i hope that you did enjoy this video it's a different type of style and um i think it was i hope that you guys found this more i guess fun than the traditional cleaning videos if you did enjoy it please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and also if you guys would like some more of these videos please let me know in the comments below and i will definitely be more than happy to film more of these type of content for you on my channel as for today that's gonna be all guys thank you so much for tuning in and i will see you guys on the next one take care bye yes every time the snow is falling down and it is